nos encontramos con el, el congresista Rob Menéndez, que también está corriendo para reelección. Uh, what's the meaning for you to be a Latino congressman? It means that I get to represent this incredible district where so many different uh, members of our Hispanic community uh, have lived their lives, continue to grow, and taking their voices, taking their stories with me to Washington is critically important. I love this district. I love everyone that lives here. And having the honor of getting to represent you all in Washington is why I work so hard every single day. You grew up in the Latino community. And do you have the chance to, to learn Spanish or yeah, to communicate so, in Spanish? Uh, it's something that I work on every single day, and I want to make sure that I get to a point where I'm completely fluent so I can converse in Spanish with all of our constituents in a fluent way. Your father is a champion in, in the Hispanic community. Um, do you think that uh, it helps to your campaign, to career? Well, I've seen, I've seen his engagement with the community his entire career, and I think about what the future looks like and the fights that we have as a community, and I want to be there fighting for our community and making sure that we continue the work both here in the district and in Washington to ensure that we always have someone in Washington who represents this district who's fighting for our community. That's what I do every single day. And that's what I will continue to do for so long as I have the honor of representing this district. What is the most important thing that you get for the Hispanic community, especially in New Jersey? There's two things. One is here in the district. Uh, we've solved almost 1,600 cases for our constituents. Over 90% of those cases are immigration related. So we're working in our communities and helping them address any issues that they have with the federal government. Two is bringing federal resources back to the district to create more economic opportunities for our community so they get to partake in, um, in their economic growth. So we continue to deliver here with results for our families. And in Washington, we're bringing resources back. Uh, we're a proud member of the Congressional Hispanic Caucus where we fight to, to uplift all Hispanic voices throughout the country. And that's the work that I do every single day. You're the only voice, the Hispanic voice in New Jersey in the Congress, right? Uh, how do you feel about that? It's, listen, it's critically important that our community has a voice in the House of Representatives. I'm currently the only Hispanic member of the House. Um, if re-elected, I would be the only Hispanic member of the House. And that means ha our community having a champion who's in Washington fighting every single day for our values, for our visions. Um, and that's, that's what this election is about. That's why it's so critically important that we go back to Washington to continue the work. Finally, what's your message to the Hispanic community? It's an honor to get to represent you in Washington. I grew up in Union City. I live in Jersey City now where I'm raising my two kids. I love every single one of our uh, municipalities. I love our community. And I want to make sure that when we have these fights in Washington, that your voice is heard, that we uplift your voice. So that way, you know that every day in Washington, you have someone fighting for you and for your family and for our community. That's why representation is so important. That's why this election on June 4th is so important. Okay, one more question. Yeah. Uh, we know that uh, your father is a very good salsa dancer. <laughs> what about you? You're practicing too? Or not? Uh, I, I, I'm going to go to Salsa on Grove with Councilman Rivera tonight in Jersey City, and I'll make sure I get some more practice in. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank uh, you. Would you like uh, to, to add something to this interview? It's just great to be with you, and I, I would appreciate your support on June 4th so I can go back to Washington and continue to fight for you every single day. Okay, thank you very much, and good luck. Thank you.